What's up, everybody? This is Taint Peter, continuing our playthrough of Blasphemous 2. This is going to be, oh geez, part 16 of our Let's Play as we go through this wonderful Metroidvania that just uh, has everybody so excited these days. As you can see, we've done some good exploring. We've beaten four bosses at this point. I was coming up here because I was hoping that we could get up this tower and over into whatever's here, but... Um, after digging, doing, digging around online a little bit and doing a little sleuthing to figure this out in order to streamline the playthrough, I figured out that the answer is somewhere down in here. I don't know exactly where. I stopped short of just looking it up exactly, but I wanted a little hint where to go, right? Because look, I could take us all over this map and I wanted to just make this kind of a little easier than that. So they said, nope, it is here somewhere. You just have to find it. So let's go down there and see. In fact, the quickest way to do it is probably going to be <clears throat> to just use this spell here. No, oh, we don't have enough magic for that. Let's go kill somebody and then we can use the spell. Hey, sir, you look killable. Not like that, of course, but maybe like this. Travel to the city. Away we go. <clears throat> okay, here we are. So, yes. I want to find my way into this general area. How will I do it? I guess not that way. Do really quickly want to check up here. Nothing, and I know to the left is a hand warp, to the right is just an NPC lady asking me to find sisters. I haven't figured that one out yet. But let's continue on our way over yonder. See what there is to see. Really, oh, well there's a mirrored person up there. I know I can use those now. Let's stop by the hand merchant first. You point. You, you point, you're a hand. Uses penalties for accumulation of guilt. Yeah, I guess that one does sound pretty good, but do I have that one? I feel like, I feel like I do. Slightly increases the damage of prayers. That does sound like it could come in handy in a boss fight, you know? Like, sometimes that magic, getting a little extra helping hand there. Could be good. Could be good. That's all I'm saying. All right, let's see here. May okay, so I can get over to that little angel statue now. And I have the ability to use it, so maybe we have found... Yes. Yes. Oh, yes. I think we have found what we need. Oh, cool. Can I go in there? Nope. Gotta just go here. Let's go up. Wow. Whoopsie-daisy. And let's go up one more time. Wow, look at that. Beautiful view. Let's take out our veredicto here. Oh, it's a merchant. What's up? I wish I hadn't just spent all that fucking money. The upper reaches of our city, once unreachable and uncountless legends tell of the many secrets that the heights have hidden. And laid watcher, can it be okay. the city that prostrates itself before so many parishioners, beckoning us to witness what holiness cast your hmm. eyes upon our shop window? Well, I could have afforded this. That's okay. I'm not in a hurry to buy those ones. I, I will. I will at some point. I have the lightning resist. I have the mystical resist. I should get my asthma resist and fire resist, which is what he was offering there. Let's see what's over this way. Please, let us take the elevator Ooh, back down. Is this going to open up another shortcut back to the main city? I think it is. I think I know exactly where we are. Yep, here we go. Been waiting for that for a while. Look, there's our main little uh, altar down there. Love it. Of course, a treasure. Okay, opened up a figurine for our little uh, altar. Kind of want to take a look, see what that is. Oops. Let's 
starting to forget which ones I've already had. I think it's this one. It increases the stun power of your attacks. Actually pretty good. And in fact, while we're here, I think I'm going to replace the one that uh, increases my block time with that one. I think that's going to be an upgrade. <clears throat> Hello, kind sir. Please, I'd like to open my older piece of favors. Increases the window of time to perform a block. Yeah, I'm going to replace you with increase the stun power of my attacks. I want to stun the shit out of people. I want to hit him and have him be like, damn, that hurt like a bitch. I am literally fucking stunned by that. That's what I'm after. I have to say, after playing Blasphemous 2 this long, I hope there's a Blasphemous 3. I really fucking like Blasphemous. I'm just a fan. Look, if they've made 1,000, and I'm not exaggerating, 1,000 Castlevania games, they can give us a third Blasphemous. That's all I'm saying. Wow, and just like that, we have elevated ourselves finally to where I've been trying to get. Love it. Anything over here? I don't know why I've just drawn this way. I wanted to go left. Elevated temples. Okay, well, something... Something will get me over there at some point. But it ain't happening in this very second. Ah, yes, here we go. Lovely. This asshole. Oh man, I thought I had my my barbecue roaster on. Hold on, let's change that. Here we go. That's what we like to see. Yes, sir. Is that my asthma? Is that what that is, huh? Oh shit. You guys want to play this way, huh? Want to double up on me? Kiss my ass. Let's try going up first. So many places to go. Gosh, let's just keep going left. Let's clear this whole thing level by level. thought you were going to pull one over on me, didn't you, you candle-wielding piece of shit? Wait, what's this? Okay. Can't get to it now. I'm drawn to it. But what, what secrets does the bell show? Okay. Ouch. That's all I can say to that. Let's try this. Let's see. Okay. Okay. All right, I get it. And then we're going to want to jump down here, do our, like, ground attack on this thing, and open it. I see. I get it. Uh, wait, it's on a timer, of course. All right, here we go. One, two, three, let's do this shit. Boom, bitty, bye, bye. Laddin' on the floor, now you all gonna die. I really fucked that up, didn't I? Oh my goodness, this is gonna be a whole thing. It's just gonna be a whole thing. All right, here we go. Smack that. Okay, god damn, all right. 
That thing's moving. Okay, boom. God damn it. I'm trying to switch my weapon and I'm hitting the wrong thing. go. That's how it's done, folks. That is how you fucking handle business. Yes. Was I that low on health? I guess I wasn't paying attention. Hmm. Alright, let's go back up there and get that shit. Thankfully that whole thing should be unlocked now. I don't think I'm going to have to do the puzzle again. So it should be relatively quick. Flying lantern. <clears throat> I have to admit, I harbor like a secret hatred for the flying lanterns in this game. Not because they're hard, they're just kind of annoying. I hate flying bosses. I hate poison, or not bosses, enemies. I mean, I hate flying bosses too. Anything that flies in a video game or anything that poisons you, I always kind of hate it. It's just a pain in the ass. I like my enemies on the ground where I'm at, where I can fight them, you know? Hand to hand, one on one, get down here on my level, let's go at it. Let's make this fair, or fair-ish. You're flying around and acting like a fucking asshole. I don't know what to do about it. it. Just feels cheap. All right, let's see here. I'm gonna light you on fire because I have no respect for you at all. back here. Ah, Mark of Martyrdom. You gotta love it. Oh, shit. Just give me my fucking thing back. There we go. That's all I want, man. That's all I want. I'll kill you in a ranged fury attack. Come on. Take that big steaming fucking thing and throw it on the ground. You know you're gonna do it. I know you're gonna do it. Let's just get this over with. Come on, let's do it one more time. Really? Are you a coward, sir? Tell me why you won't fight. Alright, let's do this. So goes another giant down to the depths of hell. I sent him there with mine own hand. Uh oh. Oh, you fucking piece of shit. Oh, these guys annoy the shit out of me. Let's do this. Okay. Who else will spawn now? These fucking guys, huh? What the fuck is this guy up to? This is a new enemy for me, so forgive me. I'm trying to understand. It's bullshit. Oh my god, you've got to be fucking kidding me. 
I got greedy, I guess, huh? Mother fucker. Ay, ay, ay. All right, well, let's go get our souls. Or, you know, whatever, our guilt, whatever the fuck they call it. I'm just going to skip these guys for now in the interest of getting to where we want to go. Boy, this shit's starting to hurt a little bit. I'm going to be honest. I feel like I need to get my uh, health thingy up here. My fervor bar's up. But my health bar remains pitifully where it was when I started the game. Is it my fault for not finding the right thing? Possibly, but I don't really think so, actually. I think... I think it hasn't come yet. Oh, these fucking guys don't. God damn you, motherfucker. Oh, am I gonna have to fight all these guys again? Maybe not. Here we go. There we go. That's what I need. Right there, baby. And let's go see if this unlocks anything to the right here that might be of interest. It kind of does. Let's see what this guy wants. Oh, you fucking piece of shit, huh? Why is this not? Utilizing my weapon of choice. Oh, for the love of God. Creating part two of this weapon now. Excellent. Most excellent. Well, let's rest here. All right, let's see. Um, yeah, I guess let's continue back down the way we were going. Yahoo! <clears throat> What's up, butthole? You know, these swords have their use, but still really kind of a big slapper guy myself. The Veridictos, unparalleled in its damage output. Oh man, how the hell are we gonna get up there? Even with a double jump, I still don't have the power. Looks like we might have to come down on top of it, honestly. <clears throat> What's over here? Okay, we can double jump this way up, oh, fucker. Check this out. What's going to be? Ooh, it's a bead. The votive offering of the miserable. As usual, let's take a look. Slightly increases resistance to all elemental damage. Man. Well, it's got only one little shield there. You'll see where it says votive of the offering of the miserable. Underneath, there's a little tiny shield icon. And then, for example, this has two little shields with lightning. This means it's, like, very resistant to lightning. This would be slightly resistant to lightning. <clears throat> I've got very resistant to mystical and slightly resistant to fire. Yeah, I mean, let's see, what are we doing here? Slightly reduces damage from traps and falls. Am I really getting hit by that many traps? Maybe it's time to replace that one. Um, God, yeah, this one feels better. Slightly reduces the amount of guilt the penitent one drops upon death. I'm going to do that. Because if there's one thing that's true about this game, it's that you will, from time to time, die. And when you die, you will feel guilty. There will be guilt. Let's see what's down this ladder. <clears throat> oh my, look at this. 
Now I have to wonder. This is definitely taking us on an interesting route. Looking for possibly a hidden door there because I can see we're coming next to this tower. With the golden baby, the golden masked fat baby child who weeps for us. Maybe I can get that with a double? No, I don't think so. Oh man, we are we are possibly going to open up a shortcut here. Let's see. Yes, we are. Hey, buddy. Remember me? I don't think I have anything new for you, but... Okay, cool. Well, now we can move freely between this area and this area. So I would say that little detour was worth it. And one question is, do I die if I fall down there? Probably. I don't see, like, a connector. Okay, let's head back up. Go back to whence we came. Yeah. Up, up and away. Get me climbing with ease now. Not a care in the world. Here, let's keep going this way. Interesting little immunity frames there. <laughs> kind of feel like I should have gotten hit once or twice. But you know what? I didn't, and hey, I'll take it. So this looks like an area where we're going to have to come back to and see this little golden sparkly thing here. Something will turn that into a stepping stone or something for us later. For now, we're going to head back. Ah, uh, yeah. Sipping a little iced coffee here, and I decided to put a little bit of vodka in it today just to have a little fun. Why did I do that? Probably because I'm drinking. All right. <clears throat> Mmm, mmm, that is tasty. If you've never had a iced coffee with a little bit of booze in it, it's kind of like a weird iced Irish coffee. Highly recommend. Get you all cranked up on caffeine, get you a nice little buzz going. Just perfect for exploring the world of basically a nightmare inquisition like the one that we find ourselves in here. All right, so I'm seeing that I don't think I can get up that way. Probably going to have to go back through here and then see what's over here. But we've done a good job of exploring that part of the map, everybody. I think we can be really proud of ourselves. Oh, you piece of shit. Wow. Mr. Dodgeworth, huh? Mr. Dodgeworth comes to town? Not on my fucking watch! And your brother, too. Your piece of shit, no good brother. Dead. Oh, what? Are you fucking... That's it. I'm lighting it up. I'm lighting it up. I don't know what else to do. All right, this feels like a time to light some people on fire. Yep, good old-fashioned... Whoa! Whoa, I guess two can play at that game, huh? Asshole. Whoa, whoa. All right, let's see how this feels. No, 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 no. Yep, here we go. Execution. That's what we like to see, baby. Put all that blood on the ground. I did that. All right, continuing through. Uh-oh, we got a fight. I guess we haven't been in this room yet. What this is telling me. Who's next, huh? Who's fucking next? You? You? You want to be next? You can be next all you want. And you two, welcome to El Pollo Loco. Flame grilled perfection. Oh, ho, ho, ho. have a taste of your own medicine, my friend. Huh, doesn't seem to be doing that much to him. Okay, gotta jump over this asshole. God, that does hurt. Does hurt. Nice, look at that. Look at that. Ooh, wow, I got knocked all the way back here. I'm gonna go ahead and try to parry that. Eat, shit, and die. All right, you know what? I'm gonna start bringing this sword out when I see those guys. That parry was sweet. Uh, oh, wow, I can bring the bell to me. Well, isn't this a nice change of pace? Usually I'm running all over trying to get to the fucking bell. 
It's about time the bell comes my way. Hold up its end of the relationship. Whoa, hey there. Light your ass on fire. I bet I can do it again. That's how it's done, baby. And let's not forget to bring this bell back, just for good measure, in case we need it. That's like rewinding a tape after you rent it. It's just good courtesy. You use the bell, put it back where you found it. Maybe dating myself here with the reference to a VHS tape rental, but... Hmm. <laughs> so, because my health is low, I think I'm gonna run from that conflict and just continue to try to find my next little... prayer station, my prie dieu, as the game calls it. Slide down here. Okay, we did that. Okay. Hmm. I could go down one here. Yes, I feel like I should just try to hit that real quick. Maybe. Oh, I know where we are. Yes, I think that is a solid call. Oh, man, I gotta go down one more. Okay. Well, back to this guy. Make this traversal a little bit easier by just destroying everything about him. Hmm. I don't have time for this conflict, guys. I've grown as a person since we last met in this hallway. Grown enough to know that I'd like to be healed before I beat the living shit out of you, which I will now do after a sip of my sweet little Irish coffee here. In fact, actually, looking at the time, why don't we pause it here and let's come back uh, in part 17. Wow, we are making our way through this game. Guys, this is Taint Peter. This is the last play of Blasphemous 2. We're having a blasphemous time doing it. God, I'm sorry about that. Fuck, I should just show myself out. All right, I'll see you guys in the next one where we will continue our exploration of the elevated temples. Peace.